this is Walkland Wing Gamertag Walkland Master, and I hope you enjoyed the two uh, real life videos I uploaded. It was uh, of me goofing around, and my friends were videotaping me. Just thought I'd try something different. And also, I did that because I've been trying to upload this one video on YouTube, but I don't know if this happened to you, but I've been having some really bad upload problems. It's like when I upload it, it says it's like taking like five hours to upload, like a thousand minutes. And then, like one time I waited that long, and it uh, never completely uploaded and just kept on saying um, the user removed it when I went to the link and so I don't know what's going on I'm hoping that was just that one time thing maybe that video was messed up or something so this is the same gameplay for that video and that I'm using now so the gameplay is uh, me using the P90 rapid fire extended mag is not my favorite submachine gun um, I go 54 and 20 not my favorite gameplay so just a decent gameplay just want to talk about uh, one subject, and you know, obviously, a lot of tangents will come off of that. Coney 2012. Now, I'm sure most of you are up to date with Coney. Um, for those of you who aren't, I'm not the biggest expert on it, but what I know of him as he's uh, pretty much uh, one of the biggest criminals, I guess you can say, international criminals. <clears throat> he's from Uganda. He's like abducting children from all around Uganda. And he's uh, recruiting them, I guess, uh, brainwashing them into his private army of what he now has about 330,000, sorry, not 300,000, 30,000 or so children that he's brainwashed. And he's using the women as sex slaves and using the men or boys, I should say, not women, girls, um, as soldiers. And so what this one guy started, at least what the video is, there's a video on YouTube, you can look it up, Comey 2012. Um, he's trying to get the word out because the U.S. is saying they're not going to do anything about it. Um, they don't want to get involved. And what I want to know, I'm not just going to be another one of the people that just talk about it, saying we shouldn't get involved because I'm sure you've heard more than enough of those. I'm trying to say that I honestly don't think anything's going to happen. I think what I think is going to happen is it's going to be exactly, exactly like the occupation. Uh, Occupy Wall Street movement, where there was extreme amounts of hype, just like the Coney, right at the start. Extreme amounts of hype. Everyone was wanting to do it, um, like just like in the Occupy Wall Street movement. Uh, like everyone was talking about it. it was all over the news. Once it started getting, you know, um, what would I say, uh, publicity. Once it started getting publicity, it was all over the news, all over the news for a while. It was crazy how many people were so hyped about it. Even if you weren't standing out there. Um, protesting. Uh, personally, me and my mom uh, dropped off like donations you could donate to the local, you know, Occupy city. Or never mind. So what I think is going to happen to Coney 2012? I think there's going to be so much hype. There may be even protestings. I don't. I don't know what currently if there's are protestings. I think there may be, or protests, not protestings, protests. And what's going to happen is nothing. It's going to be exactly like Occupy Wall Street. It's going to get publicity. Um, there may be a couple, like, um, um, I don't know what the right word is, third-party organizations, but, but the uh, you know U.S. government, I honestly don't think is going to do anything. Unless, unless, this is the one thing that has to happen, it happens quick. Because it has to happen soon, or else publicity will die down. Which uh, shows that the U.S. like the only reason the U.S. government is going to do anything is after they think people care about it, because we're already trillion dollars in debt. We don't need to send, you know, uh, U.S. Army troops down to Uganda to stop a guy, which will probably be a multi-million dollar organization, uh, organization, um, whatever. I don't know what the right word is. Um, multi-million dollar mission. And so, what needs to happen for this Coney 2012 thing to actually work? for actually him to be arrested for it to stop is that if something happens quick because if something takes as long like the Occupy Wall Street movement something takes that long to work publicity is going to die down just people are going to start care stop caring and the US government uh, can make the excuse that people don't care that much anymore and so and so uh, they're going to realize they don't they don't need to do it I mean, it's a, right now I think personally I think the U.S. government isn't doing anything more on an economic level than a moral level. I don't think the U.S. government really does anything on a moral level. So they think it's just a waste of time, which is a waste of time, is a waste of money, and so forth. 
so like I said, the one thing that needs to happen for this Coney 2012 movement for results to actually happen is um, it needs to happen quick or else it's just going to die down like the Occupy Wall Street movement and so I'm not a, I'm not a huge, you know, I'm going off kind of passionate about this just because of this topic um, but I'm actually not that big into it um, I'm not like a lot of my friends like there's a wall I think there's in the Wall Street there's a Facebook page on it at least for the town that I'm in um, so I'm, I'm sure there's town I'm sure your town maybe I don't know but is you know doing something so I'm not that big uh, interested in it and then I'm actually kind of tired already. I think publicity's already dying down this quick into the game, just because there's not people aren't seeing results. So if people aren't seeing results at the start, um, they're gonna realize this is a hopeless cause, and they don't they're not gonna put enough passion to it. The only people that are gonna put passion to it are people who really care about it, who really care about it. And honestly, I don't. I, I, I don't know why I don't feel so much passion towards this. Um, like obviously I care about the kids, but I, I think I think I just know or I feel like that it's just gonna end up like another Occupy Wall Street movement or something like that. I can't honestly. I would love for someone to comment because I have to do a political cartoon um, for my history class, and I'd love for somebody to comment about a movement that happened like the Occupy Wall Street movement, where there was so much hype, and then it died down. So if anyone could comment on that, um, because we have to make political ca ca cartoons, excuse me for stuttering, um, for my class, so please leave a comment if you could think of a movement that happened like the Occupy movement. But anyways, I think that's enough of Coney 2012, I'm sure you've heard more than enough. I'm getting tired of people posting on YouTube comments uh, Coney 2012, um, on music videos of Kanye West and whatnot. Someone left a great comment saying, I'm tired of this Coney shit, I want Kanye, because they were on a Kanye music video. Anyways, though, oh, um, on the topic of YouTube comments, yeah, the XM25 glitch I posted a while ago, um, got, it's up to 2,000 something views, at least what I see of it, and I'm really excited about that, it's the most views I've ever gotten on a video and I'm really excited about it but the only problem is people are leaving so many hate comments that's all I get is 24 7 is just not well it it's not that big of a deal it's no Coney 2012 um, publicity thing but every single time I get a new comment for that video it's about how I said that I had hater friends and I just want to clear it up in the video I said um, I have hater friends who would uh yeah, a nice C4 double. Whenever you get a C4 kill, whether it's just a single or a double or whatever, it's it's really satisfying. But anyways, back to the topic at hand. Um, I've been getting so many hate comments on that um, video because I said, oh, I have hacker friends that will demote anybody um, who who use this glitch. And that glitch is so old now and I still get in comments saying like that's the oldest saying in the book. I have com uh, hacker friends and people are just hating on me all day because I said I have hacker friends. And I want to clear it up. I wasn't threatening anybody. I wasn't like pretending to uh, show off in any way saying like I have hacker friends. I'm better than you guys. Um, don't mess with me or else I have hacker friends. You know, I don't, I'm not trying to be like, cool or anything. I was just stating a fact that I do have I do know people that are hackers, and I think the majority of people on the Wii know at least someone who's a hacker. And so I was just saying the fact that um, there's a lot of hackers. I, sh I guess I shouldn't have said friends. Maybe that would have um, made uh, less of a bias for me, uh, saying that I have hackers friends. I'm threatening you guys. So I just want to clear it up. I wasn't threatening anybody. I wasn't trying to be cool or anything. I was just stating the fact that I knew some people that were saying um, they demote you if you'd use this glitch. I was just trying to warn you guys to, you know, not do it. I wasn't trying to say that so I would have people stop the glitch for my own sake. I was just having it saying it for people who would stop the glitch for their own sake, not my sake. So, um, hopefully this video will kind of stop the hate comments, but most of the hate comments I get are from random people who aren't subscribed to me. So, I just stopped commenting back, um, against those people. So, I hope you enjoyed the video. It's kind of winding down now. I go 54 and 20. I think, I think that's what the score is. Uh, don't uh, hate on me if I got that wrong. But 
using the P90 rapid fire cinematics, like I said, not my favorite submachine gun. Would not suggest it. Uh, I would suggest the MP7 rapid fire suppressor. It's my favorite uh, submachine gun of all time. Oh, I would also suggest using. I haven't tried this yet, but using a submachine gun with silencer and range, because you know range. I mean, silencer uh, detracts range, and range adds range, obviously. And so with the silencer. Without range, you do less damage, and so forth. So I would suggest people do that. Uh, I win the game. Go, yep, look, 54 and 20 looks like, somewhere around there. Please subscribe, like, and favorite, and keep on with gaming.